Kung Cassius, IFL TV, MTK Global. We're at the final press conference here for Usyk versus Belly. I'm joined by the magic man, Paulie Mal- Mal- Malinaji. Yeah. I did a couple of ala, ala, ala. We were having a couple of hiccups with my last name. You know, you should know better. Who, Malignaggi. Who, 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 come on, you've been talking to me long enough. You should know better than that. Than, than it's been that. a long morning. It's been a long morning. Um, yeah. yeah. Huge fight on Saturday nights for all the marbles, as we're saying here. Uh, what chance to give Tony Bellew in this? It's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. Yeah, i got to be honest with you. Usyk, I, I rate Usyk as one of the best fighters in the world, pound for pound. So. It's going to be very tough, um, but you know, I, I, I think he doesn't, I, I don't think he can afford to fight a tactical fight, I'll be honest with you, I think he's just got to go for it, either he stops him or he gets stopped, I don't think he can afford to take his time and try to find openings and be patient and all that other stuff that everybody talks all this shit about, I think, uh, I think he's got to go for it, I don't think, I, I think you give Usyk time, he's just going to keep setting you up, I think uh, if you fight tactically, Usyk's just going to be better. So I think he just has to has to go for it, and you know, he, at, in spots, I think Tony acknowledges that. You know, so we'll see. If that's the case, I think it'll be a fun fight either way, no matter what. He said in the press conference that he can't outbox him. Um, so obviously, indication is he has to go for that yeah, knockout, and yeah. it's his best chance of winning. Yeah, I think that's his best chance of winning. Also, maybe Usyk is taking him lightly. I, I got the feeling that Usyk was kind of being sarcastic uh, during the press conference, you know, saying that Tony's the best fighter he ever fought. I think I thought I felt it was a very sarcastic way he said it. And I, honestly, I don't think Tony is the best fighter he ever fought. But um, also, um, um, the fact that you know when he they asked him about Tony, he said, "Look at his eyes. Look how big he is." So, so, I, it was just it was. I thought it was a play on what Tony was just saying about look at my eyes. I'm serious. You know, I'm ready for you or whatnot. So, so I think I think I think they're maybe Usyk taking him lightly also can play into, uh, into Tony's hands, you know, because I think Tony will, will come to fight, and I think Tony will come to be the bomber, you know, and 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 and, and press the press the issue. So maybe if you can catch him a little cold, because um, he's taking you kind of lightly, you know, it's you, know, you don't bank on it, but. I kind of got that feeling from Usyk on the win, that based on the way he was talking, that he wasn't taking them very seriously. Mm. I mean, Tony obviously knows what a huge task this is, and he made a lot of reference to that in, in the press conference, but in terms of an upset, if people are going to look at it like that, how big would it be for Belly to beat Usyk? Be upset of the year, can we? Without a doubt. I mean, it was, it'll be the upset of several, several years, I think, you know? It'll be, it'll be that big of an upset, you know? I think this is the kind of fight, though, you know, it's a, sort of a farewell for, for Tony Bellew. He's done a lot in his career. Uh, he's made a lot of fans because of uh, his heart and determination and being just one of the regular guys in boxing and not having his head up in the air despite being such a great champion. Um, I mean, honestly, I think he's in a no-lose no lose situation, you know. Um, I, I, I think just even if he loses but he scores a knockdown in the fight, I, mean, I think he goes out a hero, you know what I'm saying? So, so I really think that, you know, it, I, I, I don't think there's a lot of expectation, but Tony will come to fight and bring what he, what he does have to the table. Mm. There is also that thought in your head, do you back against someone like Tony Bellew? He seems to be one of these fighters that kind of finds that way to, to yeah. win, even if he's in fights that he's not expected to win. And this is kind of one of those fights. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of one of those fights. Um, and. You know, one thing that's made Tony uh, such a fan favorite and, and given Tony such good success is the fact that he's such a such a, a guy who believes in himself. His self belief is uh, is tremendous for him, and, and he's made it work for him. I don't think he's anything. He's always he's always got that, and I think that's always that's the reason he'll come to fight Saturday night, regardless of the result. He's going to come to try to make it as violent as he possibly can, if he if he can. Mm.